Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So, if you're asking yourself why I'm talking a bit like low, it's because, as you can tell from the title, I'm going to be exposing my sister, I hope she doesn't hear me, and using her nasty old makeup bag. I, I think I can talk freely because when she sleeps, she's just in her sleep. She's just taking a nap, she's like been working a lot. Um, but yeah, I've, I was just thinking of what videos to film because I have really cool videos to film like for later on but for today I wanted to get something out and I was just like what should I film and then I was thinking about this and I'm just like I feel like this is more exposing my sister than using her makeup because I just had a puke in there and I'm just like what the hell's going on, is Satan in there? Like what on earth? I'll show you guys in a bit. <laughs> so before I go on to the video, I'm going to do my post notification shout out today and today's one goes to Anissa K. So thank you so much for your little comment and thank you so much to all of you guys for the love in my last video which was all over the place but I'm, gl I'm glad I did it because it kind of got me back into like filming. Alright, let's get into it. This is the makeup bag by the way, this was given by me, I feel like most of the stuff in here is from me or I've bought because she never buys makeup, I mean recently she did buy some makeup but I think most of this stuff is me. I think she buys more skincare because she worries about her skin more than you know makeup and she doesn't really wear much. So like when you look into it, this is what I see, look at that nasty old sponge, I tell her, wash your stuff but she don't, she don't listen. So I might not put any mascara on because I just recently got a lash lift by JV Aesthetics in London. They were really kind to invite me over to do a lash lift and it's the first time I've ever done it and honestly, it's the best thing ever. Like, let me just give you guys a little close up. I don't know if you can see, but my lashes are literally touching my eyebrows. Like, I can feel them on my brows. But they're so lifted. I can't wait to put mascara on, but I need to wait like three more hours until I can do that. So... I might not wear mascara. Alright, so the first thing that she has is her moisturiser, which is the... Wait, I thought I bought mine. Is this mine? So before she went on holiday, she recently bought the Embryolis Le, Le Creme Concentré. Le Creme Concentré. So this is what it looks like, and I've been using this cream lately, and it's so good. It's very hydrating, so if you have dry skin, then I definitely recommend this stuff. It says you can use it as a mask, as a treatment. I'm getting this deep spot here, it's so painful, it just feels so nice and hydrating. It's also good as a primer, a lot of makeup artists have this in their kit and it's it's okay price, you know, compared to other moisturisers out there. She does also have a bunch of stuff from The Ordinary but I'm not going to use that, but look at her cream like. What is going on here? I got her into the Alpha Arbutin, I need to buy some more but yeah it, it looked like it really seemed to work for her. So I guess we're going to go on to foundation straight away. Um, I gave this foundation to her because she tanned so much and she's been using this every day. So I'm probably going to look like crazy but... This is the Revolution Pro foundation in number 13. C13? No, F13. Full cover camouflage foundation. And I'm sorry but I think I'm going to have to go on my foundation brush because... Or is that cheating? I don't want to use her brushes. I don't want to use her nasty old brush. She doesn't even have a foundation brush and I'm no way in hell using that sponge so I'm going to bend the rolls a little bit. I can't believe she's this shade, oh my goodness. I'm going to try and sheer it out if I can. Oh my goodness. I wish I was this colour. I don't wish, I like my skin colour but I just love it when I tan because you're your skin goes so even and it kind of like tans on the sides but stays light in the centre. I, I just really love that. Oh my god, I'm going to be looking like an Oompa Loompa. This foundation is good. Like it, it stays on all day but I just don't have like a good colour for my skin tone but for her this matches so well and it suits her really well like it sits on her skin really nicely. So for concealer she has two, she has Tarte Shape Tape and Makeup Revolution Concealer in C12. I think I'm going to go with the Makeup Revolution one. This is what it looks like, their Conceal and Define Concealer. I feel like with this foundation colour it just seems to match. Oh my god. 
crazy how she doesn't like invest in makeup much like it's always me that buys her stuff like i give her most of my stuff this concealer is so good and so affordable like when it launched it got so much hype like if you want concealer you just need to have this just keep blending just keep blending okay, so then she don't wear powder but i know she wears the mac mineralized skin finish in dark deepest which is this right here is it focusing i use dark deep but she uses dark deepest it's okay it's dark enough and more subtle oh it's okay it's showing up not that i need any more like bronzer to be honest <sighs> yes good that contour good that I think that's enough bronzer. I'm kind of liking it actually, but it's just not my skin colour. I just love how it's like contoured and highlighted. So yeah. She has a blush in here. Don't think it's for her skin colour. But yeah, she's got the, the EX1 blush in Pretty in Peach. Guess I'm going to use her brush. She's going to get pissed off if I'm using the wrong brush. Maybe like, am I touching my I mean, it's pretty. I don't think you can see it much, to be honest. For highlight, she has MAC Mineralize Skin Finish in Global Glow. Again, another product that I got for her. <laughs> Does she have a brush for this? I think she uses her finger, honestly. I think she mentioned that before. Oh, I forgot how good these powders were. But I just found myself not using MAC much anymore. That's my highlight done. <laughs> just trying to see what else is in there. I think that's all she wears. And just mascara. She don't even have eyeshadow in here. Okay, she does have this NYX thing here. Born to Glow powder in Break the Rhythm. Guess I might put this a little, a little bit of this on my lid. Like I said, I'm just going to avoid mascara for today and we're just going to jump onto the lip. And the only lip product she has in here. Oh wait she has some eyeliner but again i don't think i want to put eyeliner so i'm just gonna go in with this elf praline liquid lipstick okay it's not that bad Alright then guys, so that's it for today. That's literally everything in her bag. Oh wait, she doesn't even have brow product. She's got some brow gel. I know she does wear brows because that's a thing she wears all the time. This is the Estee Lauder brow gel, but I think this is discontinued. I'm just going to brush this through. I can't believe I gave this to her because I actually like this and I had a tinted one. It's finished and I don't know why I didn't keep the transparent one. All right, guys, that is the finished look. So apart from being appalled by her makeup brushes and sponges, um, she does her makeup good on a daily, so it's quite, it's very natural compared to me, but to be honest, I'm, I've been going more to that natural side lately. So yeah, this was fun to do. So yeah, if you guys wanna see more fun, quick videos like this, let me know. And yeah, give this video a thumbs up. I'm actually really liking this lip. Let's do a little bit of a close up. Look at that foundation line. There you go. Oh shit, that scared the shit out of me. Oh my god, I literally had to open the door with my face looking like this. I literally had to tell just ignore my face because I looked on my, we have a mirror just in front of the door and when the door opened and the light shined on my face, 
I looked like under these lights it doesn't look that bad but oh my god in daylight it's just crazy but anyways I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to hit that like button it really helps me out and also if you are new here I do have Instagram which I'm mostly on if I'm not on YouTube and that's Anushka A N O U S S H K A A anyways I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video <laughs> toodaloo